Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. Now don't run away please because this is in fact engines and more. And I know that this is not what you're usually seeing, but I strongly believe that you guys are going to enjoy this way more than usual and I will probably enjoy making this video way more than usual as well. On top of that I can now explain everything to you guys in front of the camera and that's going to make it easier for me to explain it to you guys and you guys are probably going to understand it more easily as well. Now, Recently I reached 1000 subscribers and let me tell you I never had the intention to do so. I just started making these videos for fun. I still am making them for fun but now I got a thousand subscribers with it. And well that's thanks to you guys. You guys are awesome. I like seeing the comments underneath my videos in which you guys are thinking with me and which you guys are trying to help me out. It's awesome. Please keep doing that. Now this is something new and some of you probably won't like it. So if you don't like it, let me know in the comments and then I can go right back to the old format. For today, I got something special for you guys. You're probably gonna enjoy it. And if you enjoy it, well, please like this video. And if you want to see more like this, well, subscribe to the channel. Uh, enjoy the video and welcome to Engines and More. So hello everyone, welcome to the new video. Now, I said I had something special, well, here it is. Now, I made these counter rotating propellers a while ago. You guys haven't seen them yet and that's mainly because I had a lot of balancing issues with them. The propellers would wobble a lot. And I think I fixed most of it now. I did like a little tiny spool up on the table and it would like push itself forward a little bit. It wasn't wobbling as much anymore. So I think it's ready for like a proper thrust test without itself, well, disassembling. So let's, <laughs> let's get to it. So I got the whole thing set up, got the jet on top of the thrust stand, the phone is recording the scale, the scale is gonna tell us what thrust we are getting out of the counter rotating propellers. So yeah, let's connect the battery and let's find out. So a couple of things happened here. First of all, the propeller started slipping on top of the gears. That's probably because the axle came loose inside of the gearbox. I'm not too worried about it at the moment. And then second, the axle is slipping inside of the propeller. Now I tried tightening this down again in the hope that it wouldn't be slipping anymore. And then third of all, ESC was connected the wrong way around. And that basically caused the compressor to spin into the wrong direction. So let's give it another go. So yeah, that didn't really go to plan. Apparently the gearbox jammed up. I decided to open it up again. And what I found inside was that the little axle that's holding all the gears in place basically came out and caused the gearbox to jam up. Now, luckily the counter rotating propellers are fine, but I had problems with this before and I'm gonna redesign the coupling and the axle and hopefully it's not gonna happen again. 
So thank you for watching guys and see you next time.